estate to real estate. It's Money Matters with Dina. So guys, in my opinion, the number one don't for people getting ready for retirement is don't assume anything. For example, don't assume that Social Security will be enough to live on. Do you guys agree with that? Uh, absolutely. I mean, Social Security fundamentally is uh, right now providing about 40% of uh, the income for people that are retiring. So you're missing 60% anyways. Even if you count on it being there, you still need to find another 60% to make up your income. Is it something that can really truly go away after all these years of us putting money into it? I mean, can they take that away? I don't know that I can answer that question, but I I suppose anything's possible. I don't see that happening. Even if it, but like I said, even if it, let's just say that it doesn't happen and that everything will be fine with it, you still have a large shortfall that you probably are gonna have to figure out where to bring in the additional income. Yeah. Noel, what about you? Don't assume anything. What what do you what comes what stands out in your mind? Actually, I think we should be educating our children, our grandchildren, our great grandchildren to start saving the moment they start working. It's part should be part of the plan, and maybe even taught in health in school, to in high schoolers or even junior high. Just make it part of life. Yeah, it's a great just idea. To, as long as you're saving, retirement's right there with it. Yeah, I think we have learned over the last five or six years we can't count on certain returns coming from our investments, and uh, you know we we can't uh, assume that expenses are going to go down when we retire. We can't assume that our, we're always going to earn a three percent fixed rate on our money market accounts. You know, there's just things that uh, we can't take for granted. You know, I'm going to laugh a little bit here just because I've seen it a million times over in the last few years. You can't assume that your kids are going to be out of the house once they leave the house. <laughs> <laughs> I can I can say for sure, being in my industry, how many how many times I have seen parents step in to help their kids over the last several years.